Hello, YouTube! I am Pinstar, and this is No Man's Sky Getting Started Strategy and Tactics, Episode 2! So, in our last episode, we uh, got our feet uh, wet and fixed our ship up in our starter planet. We have now successfully made it to the spaceship station here. So, let us go see here. Now, there's a very important reason we came here. I mean, saying hi to our fellow here, there's always a fellow here, is one reason. We'll see what he wants. But there's another more important reason. Yeah, let's, uh... There we go, we'll buy, buy my... All right, a tech that I'm not really interested in, and units, which, meh. But it's okay, it didn't cost us nothing. All right, uh, let's see, no wall techs uh, really to be had, just a couple of cubes here. Which sometimes have cash in them. It's kind of random what they do. But this thing is what we're really interested in. Now, you might be saying, well, Pinstar, you had one of these on the planet. Why'd you come all the way here? Just go to another freaking trade network. The reason is, this is a Drifen Trade Network. It has different prices. More importantly, it has the system's gold star prices. Let's see what they are, shall we? Shielding sheets. Don't care. Let's sell the gra gra. Sell the iron. Sell the platinum. Sell the zinc. Um, yeah, no, yeah. All right, let's see what the other gold stars are. Really? Are you kidding me? This station's only gold star product are freaking shielding sheets. Oh, that is horrific, horrifically pathetic. Ugh. Well, we're not going to want to stick around in this uh, system for too long because there's not much of an opportunity to make cash here. Not at all. Not at freaking all. These prices are horrendous. So, we're going to want to uh, uh, beeline for our uh, first uh, our first uh, warp drive tech here uh, and get the heck out of Dodge. Maybe get to a system that actually knows how to pay for goods properly. I'm not going to even sell my stuff here. I'm going to hold on to it to liquidate it in a better system. The freaking trade beacon down on the planet was better than you, you piece of crap. Ah, bah. But what can you do? Maybe these, sometimes these guys will have better prices. Let's go talk to them. Not really in a not really in a uh, place where I want to um, uh, try and buy a ship. Don't have quite enough money, but we'll see. Uh, all right, so he want, he has got a gold star power reservoir. Gravitino ball. Rykeen Effigy. So he's got gold star in all kinds of products, but uh, none, none of that I got. Oi. Oi. Alright, let's just get back to the ship. Oh, that uh, that very important tip I had for you before. Um, so, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm someone who pre-ordered. So I have the bonus content of the bonus ship. Do not redeem this until you have gotten the, um, the the recipe for both the hyperdrive and fuel cells. Otherwise, you will sort of, well, doom yourself to stay in the same system forever. And then you're going to have to use the tip that I gave you last episode to restart your game. So, yeah, just, just hold off on this. It's worth it to upgrade if you have it. Uh, but just wait. Just, just stick with the newbie shit for now. Okay, once you are out of the station, hit that scan. The system uh, should... Yep. Points you to your next breadcrumb. It might be on the same planet, it might be a new planet. We want, we're want. we going to go want to go to it regardless. We'll have to blast past here.
If you point your uh, cursor at the icon itself, it should dump you off on the planet about where you need to be um, in order to get to it. Although sometimes it doesn't quite hit the mark. I don't want to wait two minutes here. If it's a little bit further away, just blast yourself back into space. And do just a little bit more pulsing. And then just use the uh, brake button to get yourself out of pulse drive. And you get there a lot faster. Whoa, Nelly! Game! Thank you. Yeah, pretty boring burn looking planet here. Yeah, no uh, no landing pads to be had near a beacon, but that's okay. Tempered, limited, undetected, and barren. So yeah, it's a rock. It is a giant rock. It is a lifeless rock. That's okay. It's got what we need. Whee! You can see the gigantic lifeless rock. Navigational data received. Whee! And that, my friends, is where we're going to want to be headed. 30 minutes! Jeebus, you guys like putting stuff far away. What do we got in here? Gecknip, alright, that's good for some cash. And what are you floating up there in the sky? Are you... You're copper. Hmm. Copper, what is the going rate for copper here? 110 each? That's not too bad. That's not too bad at all, actually. It's not great, but it's not terrible either. Alright, we'll uh, we'll make short work of this before we take back off. Might as well. Um, I'll fast forward through all that. If you're uh, hurting on uh, on um, uh, inventory space, you can go ahead and skip this particular. Did that just regenerate itself? What? Am I crazy? Okay, no. I wait. I am going crazy. What's going on here? That was just there, but then it wasn't there. But then it's. But I, 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 I'm leaving. Let's go to our uh, marker that they gave us so thoughtfully. Yeah. It's like, what, half an hour away? Well, three minutes away by this. Uh, let's, uh, let's go to space. It'll be faster. I'm not going to make you guys sit here and wait for... Oh, for Pete's sake, game. Come on. Stop trying to send me back to the planet. I know where I'm going. Oh god, is it underwater? Okay, thank god it's not underwater. Aha! Like a glove? Ah. Nothing like a resource free landing spot. Let me go, uh, let me go pick up the, uh, the, uh, marker here. 
since that tends to have items near it that I can then turn around and sell if there's a sales thing here. Upple Peak! Upple Peak. Aha! We'll have to send some of you. Life support power. No. Shielding shard? No. Well, here's what Technology we do. Recharge. That's more like it. And those are probably just going to be junk. Oh, I'm probably going to need to clear my inventory, aren't I? Before I talk to him. Luckily I can with this. Get Nip, get that out of there. Assassination, get you out of here. I'll hold on to the copper in case it's a... Uh... Yeah, I'm gonna... Actually, let me sell... I'm gonna sell 20 of the Heridium. That's eh, not worth the shuffling through my inventory. And he's gonna give us our uh, blueprint for uh, our hyperdrive. And this is scripted, so... You don't need to worry about uh, depending on luck to get this. Uh, and since we have all that heridium, we can build it right here. Um, all we need to do is buy the dynamic resonator. And yes, you are going to want to buy that. I mean, you can eventually make it, but uh, don't wait to get the... Ooh, we can make range booster sigma attack. Very nice. Very nice. I'm happy about that. Now, what does this hold for us? Good chance it'll be at yeah, 12 slots. Oh my god, look at all that mining tech. Look at all that. Oh, yes. Come to daddy. So much mining tech. We're going to get you out of the way here. Uh, we'll get some titanium in there. Or some iron, or both. To get this gap bridged here, and then you... Well, I'll get more of the basic elements to fill out the scanner parts, but holy crap! Yeah, this thing's awesome. So yeah, all, uh, all, all, all said and good. Yeah, pick up some carbon right here. Oh yeah, let's uh, see if we can't buy ourselves that gun. That uh, dynamic resonator, see if it has it here. If it doesn't, the, the orbital station will have it. Nope, they have it here. Product received. Which means we can now build our hyperdrive and install it on our starship. Uh, let's see. We'll put it down here. Technology installed. Was I am. Now we just need to get the uh, get a thing of antimatter, which is another scripted uh, uh, factor here. Another quest thingy. But who's it? What's it? Technology recharge. Technology recharge. Might as well recharge while we're in the neighborhood. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's just get go outside, get some basic elements, so we can flesh out our multi-tool. Life support power. Oh, that was a thing of beauty right there. Ooh, look at all this. Moneymaker! We know how to shake it. Hey, let's get our a healthy dose of carbon here. And a healthy dose of iron. Ooh, this one's gonna take a while to crack. But look at this thing. Look how long it takes to overheat. All that coolant. We get a couple more. Uh, we get a couple more upgrades on here, and uh, this thing will be a mining powerhouse. Ooh. 
Whoa, bam! And look at all that linked together. Such efficiency. We don't even have to worry about moving the plasma launcher. We've got room. I mean, it'd be nice to bump it down one to get a little bit more room here. Get the, this one right here. But, eh, I'm not going to complain too loudly. We're going to get our scanner. We're going to get our analysis visor. And this thing needs some platinum. That's okay. Um, although we don't necessarily need it. I'd rather get the uh, titanium, to be honest. Oh, Sentinels! You come, gonna come say hi? Sentinels? Ooh, green. Hang on, let's uh, let's kick some stuff over to our ship here. Technology recharge. All right, plenty of goodies around here. And same rule applies. Resources that are nearby, let's vacuum them up before we take off. Mm. Such deliciousness. Hi! Hi, right, where's your buddy? You always, always have a buddy. You're behind the building. Let's get him before he calls home. Uh, don't glitch. Yep, he glitched. But that's okay. Already known. Meh. And there's our can. Neutrino molecule, all right. Let's see, can I use that to make my... Yes, I can. Technology installed. Uh, I'll hold off on the range booster. If I can move, if I can bump the plasma launcher down and move this up to here, then I can get that third one there. But for now, meh. I'm not going to kill myself over it. Ah! Now these things. These require a bypass chip, which we can manufacture. So we're going to go ahead and use this. Now, this will point you to the uh, uh, location of additional places. Um, now, as far as what flavor of place you get, well, um... The two I like the most are Transmission or Shelter. Transmission has a chance of pointing you at uh, downed ships, or rather giving you a little quest line to go find a downed ship. And Shelter has a chance of pointing you at uh, drop pods, which will give you exosuit upgrade. We need the exosuit upgrades a little bit more at this juncture, so I'm going to ask for a Shelter. It does not always... Aha! It does not always give you a drop pod, but it sometimes does. I'll take it. Such plutonium, so wow. All right, and there's also a few other uh, places here. Like this place we didn't go inside. These little, uh... Power. Yes! Plasma launcher! Get! Okay, so, we can optimize our multi-tool now. By placing the plasma launcher... Oh, we need more titanium. Poop. Alright, well, we'll kill, just kill another sentinel or two. And then what do we need for the range uh, booster here? Platinum! Yeah, one platinum flower shouldn't be too hard to find. Although, on this planet, maybe it will be. Heh. 
All right, let's go. Uh, let's do a little selling here, real quick. Let's see, aluminum. I'll hold on to it just in case. I need the titanium. Uh, all this plutonium, I'm gonna dump. Because that's way more than we actually need. Uh, we can dump the carbon. Chrysonite and copper, all those stuff we'll hold on to. All this plutonium. Yeah, we'll dump. It's good to liquidate, especially at this price. I'll hold on to the heridium just in case. Yeah. All right, let's make our way. Uh, well, we're going to want to find our next uh, shelter here. Uh, get that grub pod going. Uh, See? No. Navigational data received. Well, I'm gonna go get my drop pod first. Whee! Now hopefully you're not in the middle of the ocean. Doesn't look like it is, which is good. And drop pods never have, uh, never have landing pads by them, so just land wherever. Might as well pick up the items as you find them. And this is our lovely drop pod with our lovely exosuit upgrade. First one is free. Every uh, slot thereafter costs 10,000 more. But the price is right and the slots are always, always welcome. All right, low hanging fruit nearby. Ooh, all those treasure chests nearby. Worth investigation. Aw, oh, yeah, see? This is why you scan. Look at all that aluminum. Anything else really good nearby? No, eh, not too bad. Nice support power. Ow. All right, let's uh, let's go to our uh, quest marker here. How far away are you? Hey, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Doo -doo -doo. You'll notice I have not been scanning too much, and that's okay. I'm not going for a completionist route here. Uh, I am actually on my casual save, but that takes a lot of time. Nope, oh, I forgot to look for a landing pad. And I hit it anyway. <laughs> I have instincts. Instincts, I tell you. <laughs> uh, let's get the uh, freebies out here real quick before we go inside, because there's a good chance there's a shop in there. Treasure chests? No treasure chest. Well, we'll get the beacon anyway. A 
All right, let's make our way in. How's it going, buddy? He's gonna give us an antimatter. Thank you. Excellent. And now we can make a power cell. Oh yeah, we need a little more Thamium 9, but that's okay. Oh god, another upgrade. I'm just curious. Well, first off, well, I have the cash. 14 slots. Um, I'm going to compare. Actually, no. Because this is, well, it's 12 slots. But it's got almost everything that I need from it. Uh, and I, I, I don't have enough tech to make use of more slots. So you know what? I'm not going to buy. I am not going to buy. As much as I want to, I'm not going to. Let me see if I can buy the, the uh, platinum needed to upgrade my tool here. See if you have platinum for sale. You do. I would like 15 of it, please. Received. Let's uh received. get rid of that. Uh, I'm gonna hold out for better prices in the next galaxy here. So I'm not actually gonna be doing much in the way of selling besides the trade goods. Uh, more titanium. Okay. Let's go piss off a sentinel. See anything good in the vicinity? Oh yeah, let's go get our uh, range booster here. What am I missing here? Carbon! I can get that easily enough. Jeez, and I can get this stuff easily enough. And there's our titanium. Hostiles approaching. Warning. Sentinel drones activated. There you are. How y'all doing? <laughs> After a while, you get good at aiming the grenades. All right, well, we have the stuff we need. Technology installed. Technology installed. Now that, my friends, is a thing of beauty. Look at all these synergies here. Look at all these things. When we get a couple, we can expand it when we get a couple more grenade techs. And of course, if we get more mining techs, but this is this. Look at all of this. And we don't even need that because we have two things of combat amplifiers. So we can, even if we're not using our grenades, we can use our mining laser to do damage. Um, but seriously, no, though. The grenades are superior. That might need to be rebalanced a little bit. Uh, did I pick this one up? I did. Okay, good. All right, let me get the rest of this uh, plutonium here. Approaching. Again? Warning. All right. Sentinel drones activated. Hey, watch. I'll show you. If I can aim. Think just as effective. Let's get the plutonium sent to the ship here. Yeah, these things have physics, these little canisters, so watch where they roll. Hey, I was just talking about grenade tech, and look what you delivered me. Ask and ye shall receive. Ooh, a little 
some cave in there. Anything good? Nah. Not really. Alright, where was, uh... Ah, the neutrino module. Excellent. Plenty of good trade goods to be had. Not to mention the titanium itself is worth uh, a, a pretty penny if one liquidates it, which I intend to. All right, let's go back and liquidate the trade goods at the very least. Oh, and I never got the uh, never got the tech back here. Ooh, beam coolant. Well, I need uh, I need iridium, uh, which is a lot harder to get than heridium. All right. Uh, get, the, get these new, neutrino modules out of here. All right. We're going to get a little bit more of our Themium 9 from space. We are done with this wor this hunk of junk world. Ooh, we are all full up here. Hang on. Let me send some stuff back. That's better. All right, we should have enough for our uh, thing so we can manufacture our uh, warp fuel. Technology recharge. That's more like it. All right, let's go to a more profitable uh, system, shall we? Five planets, excellent. Let us go. All right, folks, so in our next episode, ha, you tried to give me an achievement. In our next episode, we will go to see what this next system has to offer us. We'll be getting uh, more recipes and do a little bit more intensive planetary, um, planetary exploration here. Oh, what the heck? Let's go. Uh, let's go visit the station first before we end the episode. Let's see what uh, race governs this uh, particular sector of space. All right, and hopefully this place has better sale prices too. That's the other reason for my early departure. Usually I stick around in my home system a little bit longer, but those prices They'd be crazy. All right, more Viking. That's okay. We already have a couple of their words and uh, some decent amounts of standing here. But what you got for me? We will share some oxygen. Units received. And yep, more rep. Rebound. Don't like that one. All right, gold stars. Give me, give me a winner. Give me a winner. Mm, shielding sheet. There are no winners here. It's the same bloody prices. We're gonna have to find another, uh, 
We're gonna have to find another uh, uh, another race's space in order to make this work for us. Not ideal. I'm gonna hold on to some of these for more advanced recipes. All right, folks. Well, that was has been the uh, end of an interesting episode here. Um, so if you like this episode and you want to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and leave me a comment, good, bad, or indifferent. Your feedback is always welcome. So until next time, this has been Pinstar signing out. See ya!